Yo, what is up guys? For today I'm bringing you the final video of all my Guardians and obviously my Warlock's the last one, which is fitting because I rarely play her. Yeah, it's, that's why I play her a bit, but I don't play her as much as I, sh I used to. So, like in every of these videos that I've made, if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns about what I'm wearing, how to get certain things, etc, etc, let me know in the comments below. I'd be more than happy to share my knowledge and tell you how to get certain things. Without further ado, let's begin. So unfortunately, this is probably gonna be a short video because that's this is it. This is how my warlock looks 100% of the time. That's a lie, 80% of the time. Now, unfortunately, like I said, I don't play my warlock as much as I should, really. But that's mostly because I play with my hunter and then get on my titan and then I can kind of get tired of playing with my, just in general, so. What I end up doing is I end up getting on to do the weeklies for the Bright Dust. If you guys can see right here, my Bright, Dust, my Bright Dust is a little low, mostly because they were saying a lot of good stuff last week and this week. So I have not done the weeklies for anyone yet. I probably going to do it for my Warlock because I was having a lot of fun with her. Like what yesterday I had, I was playing with her a little bit. So shut up, Tony. Just show me her gear. Okay. Okay. So. If you guys haven't seen, I'm trying to go for this look right here. Let me put some, there you go. So you guys can, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm trying to go for this like blue look. Unfortunately, I have another helmet that goes well with that, but it conflicts with these boots. And from what I've seen, these boots are the only boots that like give you some sort of color down there. So that means I have to wear this one, which does show a little blue, but I mean, at the same time, I wish it showed them more. So. This is honestly how my Warlock looks. I think my Warlock looks really cool. Like I said, I don't like to wear more than, actually I don't like to wear any of the same outfit in the same outfit, if that makes any sense. So like, for example, th these two are from the same season, but they're from, this is from Eververse and this is from the Battle Pass. So that's why I'm kind of like, that's fine. That doesn't bother me. But if people are like, that's cheating Tony, I could wear this probably. Yeah, I still think this looks cool, but I like to at least not wear the same getup. So it's like this would be cheating because these two are from the same thing, from the same armor set. That's why I'm wearing this. That's just to explain my rule a little more. It's just a rule I made for myself. That way I can not like just wear two pieces of the same armor set. If that makes sense. It's a really weird, weird rule that I follow, but it's just something I like to follow. That way I can like really try to think outside of the box especially for like the warlocks and the titans they have their they have a lot of armor that's really finicky especially the war warlocks warlocks arms are garbage fucking garbage bro i feel bad for you guys but yeah let me know what you guys think about my warlock i think she looks really cool i love love how she came out it's one of my favorite armor sets right now but if you were to ask me if there was another way i would like to look or another way just to look in general Let's uh, find out. Oh shit! Yeah, so I used to I used to wear this a lot. Where is it? So this is one of the iron. This is like, I think this was what a uh, season of the Undying. This is the armor set that I was wearing. Oh, hold on. Different color. Is that really? Yeah, that's it. So it'd be something like this, which she looks, it looks a lot better in a different color. Let me see if I can find a different color. Maybe this. Oof, that looks bad. This one? This one. That looks bad. All right, let me just switch to the old color that I used to have. Cause, oh man, guys, I'm not even kidding when I tell you that I, have tried so many like different combinations. Yeah, this is the what this is the color scheme I used to have in uh, Season of the Undying. And I thought it looked really cool. As you guys can see, I'm not wearing any of the same thing. This is Iron Banner. This is a uh, Eververse. Eververse. This is like Season One Eververse and like last season, like uh, Season of the Undying, plus Exotic and then Battle Pass. So. This is, this is another set that I would wear a lot, but I don't have enough armor to like really do a whole build. I think I have one build for 
max discipline, which is like grenades. So I think that's the only one. And that's if I want to be really fucking gross and use like a... What is this grenade called? Y'all already know what I'm th thinking about. The handheld supernova. When I'm, when people are being super fucking assholes. Oh, you guys already know. You should know. But yeah, I, uh, this is pretty much my warlock. Like, I have nothing to add. Like, my warlock's just so... I just don't play her much, unfortunately. But let's see the weapons. So, old fashioned with demolitionist and moving target. This shit hits like a fucking truck. And it's awesome because they, it has demolitionist. For the, type, for the warlock, it's invaluable dust rock blues uh this is probably one of the better roles i've gotten it's smooth work gross but yeah it's a it's an okay roll i wish it dropped with something else instead of fully auto but whatever breakneck which i love spare rations the curated roll which is meaty as fuck this is a lot of fun to roll with it's not even i'm not even kidding guys and Patron Lost Causes, I think I got the God Roll for this if I remember correctly. I'm pretty sure I got the God Roll for this, but yeah. Range plus Rapid Hit and Explosive Payload, which is gross. Or Opening Shot. This one's really good. And actually, one of my previous videos, I talked a lot of shit about this weapon. I was wrong. This weapon's really fun. Trust, I have Snapshot Sights with Rampage and Drop drop mag which is cool with a range mod on it i think i think this is really good i haven't used it a lot but i think i would probably master work this and use it a lot more if i did recluse boring retail tail so quick draw with slide shot i don't know why i have this on her but whatever really good quick draw with demolitionist again really good for the warlock traveler's judgment rapid hit with uh dragonfly i think this is an awesome loadout i just wish that i had something else another roll there's a few good rolls with the traveler's judgment that i'm i've been thinking about doing oxygen oxygen sr3 not a bad scout could be better though outlast with rangefinder and rampage pretty good and last man standing with demolitionist which again dope night i don't even know i have that oh for the for the warlock uh, jumps Pyroclastic flow, quick draw with auto loading holster. I love this. I love this. This is probably one of the coolest fucking weapons I have right now. Not because it's like powerful or anything, but just quick draw and then auto loading holster. Excuse me. Just means that I can shoot and then put it away and then it just reloads. I love it. Swarm of the Raven with spike grenades because I do not have a third love and death, but this is still great. And then Bite Almonds with Tracking Module and Cluster Bombs. Edgewise, which I still think is pretty good now. And then Tractor Cannon with Leviathan's Breath. Like I said, this character's pretty, pretty much not like, I just don't use her. Like, it's, like I use her when I have to. She's, ba she's basically just like an extra brightest income at this point. Don't get me wrong, Warlocks are dope. They're a lot of fun. It's just... After I play with my hunter and do everything on my hunter, I do go to my titan and then all my energy is just spent from there. For, like I said on the other videos, my warlock is hive themed. So you will see the Scarlet Swarm shell, which I think is pretty cool, I guess. And then the Blood Runner, which is pretty cool, I guess. And then the refashioned shape, which again, this one I can't even say is pretty cool because it's essentially just this ship right here. But like, you know, not that color. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I Like I said, this is probably gonna be a short video even though I think it's already at the length that, as the Titan one. Let me know what you guys think. Again, if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns about the armor that I'm wearing, the weapons that I got, let me know in the comments below. I'll be more than happy to answer any questions you may have. If you like the video, like the video, comment, subscribe, everything. I would really much appreciate it. Thank you for coming to this showcase of my guardians, essentially. And other than that, I will see you guys later.